I have before CrossFit? My tree temple. What? My tree temple. Oh. Twas the night before CrossFit, when all through the gym, not a creature was stirring and the lights were all dim. The jug ropes were hung by the GHD with care, in hopes that Pukey the Clown would soon be there. The crossroaders were nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of kettlebells swung in their heads. And Connor took off his five arms as Caitlin rolled out her quad, but they had just settled down after a long blue wad. When outside the room there arose such a clatter, Connor sprang from his box to see what was the matter. Away to the door, he flew like a flash, stood up too quickly, and threw up in the trash. When once was wondering I should hear, but a sick looking clown with all sorts of gear, with a sly little look, ever so lightly and quick, Connor knew in a moment the clown was sure to be a dick. More rapid than burpees, his trait first they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Spieler, now Wolf, now OPT and Bosman, on Everett, on Freddy, forget that old guy Greg Glassman. To the top of the road, to the target on the wall, now dash away, dash away until you all fall. As dry heaves that before the wild vomiting fly, when he meets with an obstacle, he doesn't feel shy. So up to the crossfit, the clown he did fly, with a sled full of toys, pukey must have been high. And then, uh, with a twisting, Connor heard at the door the pounding and calling of that stupid clown whore. As Connor drew in his head and was turning around, bursting through the door came P Pukey the Clown. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all, all, were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of weights he had, he had flung on his back, and he looked like Jesse Gray, as a matter of fact. <laughs> His face, how it sank, his arms were so hairy, his eyes were so red, he freaking looked scary. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, but I must repeat, what a hoe. <laughs> the stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth, and a smoke it encircled his head like a reed. He, he had a narrow face and a real Nike belly, to tell you the truth, he was really quite smelly. He was awkward and weird, that old crossbow clown, and Caitlin laughed, laughed when she saw him, that's when the clown started to frown. Soon gave uh, a twitch in his eye and a twist of his head, soon gave Connor to worry the clown was so close to half dead. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and loaded all the bars, then did a split jerk. And just before running, as he got ready to pose, you could, root, you could honestly see he was way on his toes. He sprang to his sled, to his team gave a whistle, and, and away they all flew like the down on a pistol. But I heard him exclaim there, he drove out of sight, get your protein on, and have a good night. Woo! <laughs>